This reading is for a business, a Virgo's business, a Virgo with an idea or a business idea. It's basically a reading to give you spiritual insight into what's going on with your business and what you can do to reach levels of new levels of success. Um, I provide this service to my monthly subscribers with businesses just to give them insight get, you know into strategy and spiritual guidance into what is required in order for them to reach the level of success oh you got two eights right off the bat resurrection um just to help them reach the level of success that they would like to in their business you know a lot of people do personal readings that's cool too i do personal readings as well but I want to focus on business and I want to focus on success. That's just what I do. So that you can reach the level of success that is required um, for your life. And more life and light in your life. So, so Virgo, so far we have the Strength card. We have the Eight of Swords. We have the Four of Pentacles. We have the Four. This is interesting. Off the bat, we have 8844, which is 888 resurrection interesting so something you're about to it's about to be new levels in your business then you okay so you have the four of pentacles you have the emperor you have the knight of swords and you have the lovers Ooh, this is awesome this is and then the overall bottom of the deck energy we have the seven of cups meaning this is for a business that results you might you might not think you're getting results but don't be fooled. Don't let that fool you because resurrection is near. And what I mean by resurrection is new levels, reaching high levels of success, um, reaching your goals. This, this is beyond reaching your goals beyond. Um, oh, yeah. Do I want to take these two? I think this is good enough. This is too many because this is four more cards. Completion. I'll take both of these. So, um, yeah, this is new levels. Dang, I can't take all y'all. Come on, man. Haven't used my chakra rhythm oracle cards in a while. All of them wanted to pop out. Um, but you also got the faith card and you got completion. This is, yeah, it's about to be lit for your business. So anyway, let me get a feel and intuitive message and see what it is that spirit is trying to tell me about your business. And while I do that, please watch this short video. And I'll be right back. I've manifested over $200,000 so far, but the most important thing that I've manifested is my connection with spirit. I have the ability to communicate with spirit guides that give me strategy. They help me to attune to hurdles along the way, and they keep me on a straight path towards the manifestation of my goals and making sure that I, when I do something wrong, they let me know to keep me in the process of manifesting the desires of my heart. And I want to use my power, my connection with spirit to help you manifest your goals as well. If you want to manifest a new job, if you want to manifest a new car, if you want to manifest more money, if you want to manifest more life, a divine partner, a baby, whatever it is that you are yearning for, allow me to assist you and allow my spirit guides to assist you in your manifestation process by providing you with bi-weekly guidance and strategy towards the manifestation of your goals. I'm looking for 33 people to help. And if you feel like you're one of those 33 people, hit the link below. Thank you. Good luck and peace. Hey Virgo. Okay, so the first thing I noticed in your business reading is 888. That just signifies that you are about to reach new levels and new heights in your business. Second thing I noticed is the Seven of Cups, the overall energy of the reading. So this is telling me that things are going on in your business. Maybe you're not seeing the results. You're not seeing the desired results from your business, but it's, it's trickery. It's... Um, you have you can't pay attention to that it's not real it's an illusion the results that you're getting right now is an illusion because you're about to reach new levels you're about to reach new heights the third thing I noticed is the love is card but what notice what I noticed the most about it is 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 right by the Emperor card you see how the Emperor is four and then it's a six you see how it's IV and V1 see you know this is opposing forces this is finding, um, having faith in opposing forces and unifying opposing forces. So this is just telling me like things are looking like it's going bad. Things are looking like it's going one way, but it's actually going the other way. So you have to see the good in the situation. You have to look for and see the good in the situation and remain faithful. Keep the faith. 
The oracle cards that you got is faith and completion. This phase, is, oh, this is so deep for you. I love it. You have to keep the faith. You have to keep the faith. Look at this. 888 in your reading. Then you have the faith oracle card and you have the completion card. Look at this. Completion. 888 is resurrection. What does resurrection mean? Coming back from the dead. Rising. Um, overcoming an obstacle. Reaching new levels and new heights after a period of temp after a period of a test or a, a fall of some sort. Look at this. This is a, literally a grave with the people right there watching. This is this is you coming back from. This is your business, not you. I'm sorry. This is your business rising again after a period, maybe after a, a drought or a feeling of failure or some sort that you thought was a failure, but it wasn't what it saw. It's not what it seems. It's a setup for a comeback. It's a setup to rise again. Whatever it is that you're going through, Virgo, you're about to rise. Your business is about to rise again. With the strength card, it's asking you, not only is this a message of 888, but it's also telling you to remain faithful, keep the strength. Um, with the Eight of Swords, is basically saying you might feel trapped or you might feel like it's not going the way that it's supposed to, but the bindings are loose. No, freedom is near. Uh, new levels of success is near. You are near completion of a phase in your business, and it's going to bring good results. So keep the faith. Hold on. Hold on to your business. Hold on to what you're doing. Continue to put the hard work in. Don't let go yet. It's, it's solid foundations are being created. This is, you know, usually the reading will tell me you need to work harder or you need to, what, no, whatever you're doing, keep doing it. You're doing a great job. Even though you may not see the results that you think you're, you're supposed to have right now, resurrection is near. I have complete faith that your business is about to take a turn for the better. You're about to rise. Maybe other people thought that. Maybe people were telling you to quit or maybe you feel like you want to quit or maybe you feel like you're not getting the results you want or that your business is about to end. But no, it's about to rise. So if it looks like it's about to end, it's about to rise. Whatever this opposing force is, it may look one way. Don't believe it. Your business is about to take off. Don't believe it. I'm telling you. You have the Knight of Swords. Stay fighting. Stay in the fight. Keep fighting for your business because it's about to rise again and it will be worth it in the end. We already talked about the lovers, about having faith, even if something is not seeming the way uh, in opposing forces. If it doesn't seem like it's going the way that you want it to, just keep the faith. Keep the faith. I think I'm going to name this Keep the Faith. Your business is about to rise again. Yeah, because this is awesome. This is, this is a great reading. This is this is totally positive for you. It may not seem things may not seem the way that um, you want them to be. You may not really be receiving the results that you feel like you should be receiving. But keep holding on, keep fighting for your business. You are going to rise again. I'm not just saying this just to fluff up any message or video. This is literally the reading. You got faith. You got completion. You literally got a grave here. You got 888 resurrection. Your business is about to come back from the quote-unquote dead. Don't stop. Don't end your business. Hold on. Keep fighting. Keep the faith. A solid foundation is being created, and it's going to be better than you ever imagined. I hope this helps. If you like a personal reading for your business, click the link in my description. I'll be happy to help you. Uh, hope this resonates. This is a, a wonderful reading for whoever business this is for. I wish you love. I wish you light in your business. Peace.